Hey guys, and today we're going to be reviewing probably the best Jurassic World toy by Hasbro in 2016 when they released it, and that is the Hybrid Rampage Indominus Rex. Now let's take a good look at this guy. So the first thing I want to talk about is the story. So I saw this guy, I heard that this was coming out, I pulled it up, and I thought it looked pretty cool, so I put it on my Christmas list. So eventually I got it for Christmas. And it's actually, it's got really, really good sculpting. It's really good. I, I would actually recommend this one. And, you know, there's no goofy lights over here with a wound you can't, like, cover or anything. That looks ridiculous, but um, there's nothing, like, that goofy on that. Um, this, however, I wish that there was a removable dinosaur damage piece right here. And then right here would be the button for this, which I'll show you in a second. Um... So, the first thing, I guess, is the sculpt. The feet are pretty well done. Yeah, and focus. Focus. Focus! The feet are actually really good. The paint's a little goofy on the feet, but um, it's pretty good. The legs are also really well sculpted. The whole thing is actually really good. The tail. You can see an overview of it. I mean, it's, it's just so cool. Like... This is actually the best Jurassic World toy ever made. This is the best one. And you can see there's some very familiar coloration. Can anyone comment in the section in the comment section what it is? Let me know. Which I mean I, I know what it is, but just that's a quiz. Um the head is actually really well done. It looks so real actually. It it, it just looks so cool. The eye is very well done. The, this thing, whatever it is, like, the nostril or something. Ugh, oh my gosh, no. It's not the nostril. But, um, whatever that is on the front, that's pretty good, well done. It's sculpted, even there, in there. The eyes, well sculpted. This hole over here, too, I guess that's the ear. It's a very big ear. That's well sculpted. The, um, oh, here, here I am. Um, the, um, the spikes are well done. There's no, like, s like sloppy sculpting or anything like some of the bashers and biters that Hasbro did. Um, this side, it's pretty good. But then, on the other side, there's screw holes everywhere. Sc I like to call them screw-up holes. The screw holes. Get it? Ugh. Oh, my gosh. Um, sculpting is just as good on this side. And now let's get to paint. The paint is uh, very familiar, as I said earlier. Um, uh, it's pretty well done. I like the stripes. It's, I like how they added the st at stripes. It's so cool. And um, I like how they used it, the red on the head. I wish there was a little less red on the head so it looked more like the real Indominus. And the feet on the, I mean the, Sculpting and paint on the feet look kind of weird, but it's it takes a little getting used to. It's still pretty cool. The arms are actually very well sculpted and painted. I'm act, I'm really really impressed with this figure. So let's get into its electronic features. So the first one is if you press this button over here. It'll make that like a I don't know, I guess a painful noise? It, like, it sounds like it's in pain. Like, remember the scene where it was blew up by that... It was almost blown up and it was, like, burning and, and it made that noise? Um, it makes another noise, like, more of a familiar one. Those are the two noises it makes when it does that. And there's so many, so, so many other noises. I don't even know if I can fit those into this video. There's a ton of noises. And if you do this, it'll bite. Wait, it makes a biting noise. Which is pretty cool. And also, if you open the mouth, it has a fang reveal, which is also pretty cool. Um, it looks kind of goofy from the underside. That, yeah, it looks obvious, but from here, that actually looks awesome. The, the mouth, like the back of the mouth, it looks, you know, it's not that good. The tongue is pretty well sculpted. Um, and uh, 
It's just, it's a pretty decent figure. Actually, oh. another feature that this Indominus Rex has. Um, not, it doesn't really work that well on mine anymore, but if you, like, jabbed the, um, the arm up and down, up and down, over and over, it would do the biting mechanism more easily. Wait. Which is actually really cool. If you own one of these hybrid Rampage Indominus Rexes, I wouldn't recommend you do this feature too much. It's because I did that on mine and it kind of messed it up. But I can still do the biting mechanism, which is pretty cool. And you can see, you know, the Jurassic World symbol, which makes these, like, the official toys to the movie. Yeah, I would actually, I would recommend this figure. Um, it's really good. You kids, or I guess you, might like it. It's a really good figure. I would really recommend it. Wow, you. this toy is also awesome. I would actually more recommend the vintage Jurassic Park toys from the older days. But if you can't afford those, this is a really, really good option for your kids, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please slap the like button and subscribe for weekly to monthly videos. I'll see you guys later. Bye.